Massively multiplayer online first-person shooter game MMOFPS mixes the genres of first-person shooter and massively multiplayer online games, possibly in the form of web browser-based games, in which a very large number of players interact with one another within a virtual world. In other words, an MMOFPS is a real-time, online gaming experience to be played within a massive in-game area which features a large number of simultaneous players in a first-person shooter fashion. These games provide large-scale, sometimes team-based combat. However, due to the inherent fast-paced, strategic nature of this genre, players must rely on their physical coordination and cognition, and thus, there is an emphasis towards player skill rather than player statistics, as no number of in-game bonuses, or similar, will compensate for a player's inability to aim and think tactically. History. Neocron is sometimes considered the first MMO FPS, most consider it a hybrid of MMORPG and first-person shooter, with the later Planetside allowing 399 players all to fight together on the same map. Some may consider Zipper's Mag an MMO FPS as it allows up to 256 players to fight together on the same map. The biggest MMO FPS to date is Planetside 2, sequel to the original game. It is able to support up to 1,200 players in a single map, or continent of the game with a max cap of 4,800 players on a single server fighting across different continents. A recent notable MMO FPS was Dust 514, developed by CCP and intended to integrate with the MMORPG EVE Online. Economics. Many MMO FPSs feature living economies. Virtual items and currency have to be gained through play and have definite value for players. Such a virtual economy can be analyzed using data logged by the game and has value in economic research. More significantly, these virtual economies can affect the economies of the real world. Topic: See also List of free massively multiplayer online games List of massively multiplayer online first-person shooter games Server emulator Virtual goods Digital currency Virtual economy Virtual world